So, Brett, how did you start with the technicals initially? I graduated from college and um, applied for a job at a stock brokerage okay. in Atlanta, Georgia in 1999 that specialized in technical analysis. Great. It was a firm uh, run by a man named Mark Scott, okay. who was previously the vice president of the CMT Association, oh, wow. as I am today. Correct. Uh, he, I consider him to be my mentor. Wow. And he is the gentleman who first introduced technical analysis to me. Great. In fact, uh, having uh, attended a university that did not teach technical analysis at all, okay. I had no understanding of it, no knowledge of technical analysis, okay. only of the stock market and fundamental investing. And at this firm, which was uh, called the Volume Investor, okay. uh, the people I interviewed with all asked me how much I knew about technical analysis, and I said none. <laughs> But I was very, I was a hard worker, I was very eager, and they gave me the job, and I um, sat every day with traders around me. Okay. Everyone was performing technical analysis. It was a sell-side oriented firm that serviced institutional clientele. Okay. Um, so they had a select group of clients, maybe 100, 120 institutions that they serviced, some large, some small. Um, and they also managed a quantitative stock selection fund that was based off of technical analysis primarily. Okay. Some fundamental indicators, but primarily technical. And I was taught how to manage that process of the quantitative model stock selection, which ran every night. Great. So over the course of about five years at that firm, I had a deep dive into technical analysis at, the, at, at work. Then also I was encouraged to attend CMT chapter meetings in Atlanta, Georgia. Okay. And in uh, late 1999, I uh, went down to Robinson Humphrey on uh, Peachtree Street, and I got to meet the co-founder of the CMT Association, okay. John Brooks. Okay. And he was in attendance at a meeting there. Okay. And uh, the presentation was by some visiting technical analyst, I can't even remember, but I got to meet Fred Meisner, past okay. chapter chair of Atlanta, and also past president of the CMT Association. Uh, Tim Snavely, who was a longtime uh, a board member, also passed chapter chair in Atlanta. It. So it was a, a great birth into technical analysis. I got very lucky. Uh, and then later on in my career, I got more education in fundamental analysis. Great. So I'm sort of upside down from the way most people learn. Usually people learn fundamental first, technical later. Yeah, so you started with technicals first. Yes. Great. Yeah. So it's my passion. It's my first love in, in finance. And uh, I'm very happy to continue to serve the association today. I'm especially happy to be here in India. 